Hi, right, today I'll be showing Windows users a great free utility known as CCleaner. You can download CCleaner off the web by just searching Google, typing in CCleaner. It's going to be the first link that pops up. Once installed, when you open up the interface, it looks very similar to this. What CCleaner does is it removes any temporary internet files or any other kind of junk files that are slowing down your computer. Um, you get these by just doing everyday things like searching the web, uh, you know, typing in uh, web histories. It's it's something that really isn't avoidable, but this is a great tool that will take care of any kind of uh, um, files that's bogging down your system. So um, generally, you don't really want to mess with any of the tabs highlighted unless you know what you're doing. Um, if you don't want any of your cookies removed, um, what cookies are, are just username information, passwords, uh, things of that nature. So if you don't want to have to re-enter in your Amazon.com uh, information, go ahead and uncheck cookies. But it's recommended that you get rid of those. Um, it's not a big deal uh, to have to type in stuff, but some people, you know. But you also have other, other options like... Uh, you can delete your autocomplete uh, forms, uh, like when you type in your address, or your name, and all that stuff like that. If you don't want that stuff staying on your computer, it's a good, quick way of getting rid of that. Um, and generally everything else, uh, unless you really want to, you know, give this thing a thorough cleaning, um, most things you can just ignore um, and just run everything in its default. So once uh, you have everything selected, you just go to Run Cleaner. It's going to say that it's going to permanently delete your files on your system. Uh, just hit OK. Now, depending on how much stuff you have on your computer, it's going to really determine the speed of your test. This uh, PC that I'm doing this demo on uh, is fairly clean, so I don't have too many things on here. Uh, but it did find a couple different uh, junk files, so. Uh, once it's ran, files uh, that were deleted were these right here. And there's also another utility on CCleaner. Um, you can clean out your registry. Uh, generally, you don't need to clean out your registry, only if uh, you're experiencing a lot of error messages uh, saying that Windows cannot find certain .dll files. Uh, this will take care of that problem by deleting the registry entry that it's looking for. Um, and that's uh, the overview of CCleaner. Thanks for watching.